thanks for subscribing to a podcast series from Dave Cusack's New Artist Model, the online music business school for independent musicians. Our podcast series interviews musicians who are blazing trails in the digital era to help inspire other musicians to develop their own strategies for success. Our first series of interviews features MC Lars from Los Angeles, who has been touring internationally and releasing albums independently since 2003. MC Lars calls his music post-punk laptop rap and attributes much of his success to the philosophies and insight offered by Dave Cusack in his new artist model program. Check out MC Lars at mclars.com and follow him on Twitter at mclars. For free lessons and to find out how to enroll in Dave Cusack's new artist model, including his master class, essential class, or individual modules to help musicians fine-tune their skills, visit newartistmodel.com or follow Dave Cusack and New Artist Model on Twitter. My dad's ghost tells me, swear, 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 to revenge my regicide. Body decides me one night under my crown, he tries to hide. So hammer keeps... So when I was still in college, I was working with this fantastic company called Network. They're based in Canada. Um, now they have offices everywhere. A guy named Terry McBride um, started it, and he was always on the forefront of thinking about the new artist model uh, approach to music. What I really loved about Network was they helped me start my own imprint. So Horace Records is my label. I own all of my masters, and we, they just helped me get distribution deals. And it was really cool because back in, my first debut came out in 06, and um, it was hard to get on iTunes then, but they helped me launch my label and figure everything out on my own. They started out working with industrial artists like Skinny Puppy, and the kind of that world. Then Terry started working with like Sarah McLaughlin and Coldplay and Avril Lavigne. And my first manager, this guy Tom Gates, worked with a band called Brand New. So he had incredible connections in the indie and punk world. And when I was starting out, I was sampling that kind of music. And he, I, I was in England doing a DIY tour, and he read some press about me and came to a show I did at college at my old college. And what I learned from that experience. Um, in 2009, I went off and um, was doing more of the academic stuff, and I went off to do it on my own because the company had changed and a lot of people had been laid off and stuff. And um, what, I, what I learned from Network is two things. First of all, they're a really good company because they were very much all about the artist. I had friends who had signed with major labels, and now they don't own their publishing, and they're... I mean, much love to them. They, they they got, you know, financially it was problematic because they ended up signing 360 deals and giving away their merch and their touring and, and they don't own their masters. Network is all about sustainability. And I think they you can call them an indie management company even though they were so big. They um, That's the model of the indie model about, you know, I've been able to do this for so long and I learned about that sometimes getting that quick advance can can bite you because... The music industry is so uncertain. You want it's better to be small and um, do things on your own terms, and that's why I thought Network was great, and that's why they're still great. And I'm still in touch with them, and we still, you know, work together on stuff. And but but they they don't manage me. I'm self managed. But I think when you're starting, it's good to have a good manager if he or she knows what they're doing, and you trust them. Don't sign something unless you've worked with them on spec for I would say six months, and they can prove that they're helping because. There's nothing worse than being locked into something that's not going to help your career. You're a feeling sad song when the full moon's bright. Baby, I'm sorry I messed up. Good night. My Check out MC Lars at mclars.com and follow him on Twitter at mclars. For free lessons and to find out how to enroll in Dave Cusick's new artist model, including his master class, essential class, or individual modules to help musicians fine-tune their skills, visit newartistmodel.com or follow Dave Cusick and new artist model on Twitter. Yes, you know, you gotta see.